Temperatures are expected to stick around with wind chills dropping into the single digits this weekend. While some of us will be finding ways to get cozy and keep warm in our homes, the reality for a lot of people is they'll be searching for a place to keep warm. These are dangerous temperatures we're talking about. News 12's Taylor Martin live from the Salvation Army Center of Hope. So Taylor, what are they bracing for? What are those organizers trying to get in place before this cold spell? The Center of Hope started check-in just about two hours ago at 4 p.m. and they told me they're expecting about 150 people, not only tonight, but for the rest of the weekend and through the cold. And I talked with volunteers earlier about how they're preparing to help people have somewhere warm to stay this weekend. Joseph Marley has volunteered at the Center of Hope for seven months now. He says he feels fulfilled helping people every day but especially when it's cold out and people have nowhere else to go. It's cold outside, it's rainy out there. There's people waiting to come in right now, their socks are wet. So, you know, it's, it's rough, it's rough. At this time of year, the Center of Hope expects to see nearly 150 people per night. Over the past week of cold weather, they've seen more families coming through their doors than usual. Major Jonathan Raymer at the Salvation Army tells me they are constantly working to better serve the community. So we want to continually do the best we can to serve as many people as we can, uh, as again, as best as we can. Uh, and so that, that can sometimes feel overwhelming, but we are constantly working through um, making it even better for those who are in need. Although the Center of Hope is an emergency overnight shelter, they accommodate for cold weather by staying open all day, every day, so people don't have to return to the cold after an overnight stay. As for Joseph, he just hopes more people become more compassionate toward those who need help. Because a lot of people aren't even interested. They, they just go about their day-to-day -day lives and forget about folks that really do need help. They drive by them or people are cold. Lines here at the Center of Hope start at 3.30 p.m. every day and check-in begins from 4 p.m at 4 p.m. and last until 9 p.m. So if you're out in the cold and you need somewhere to go to get out of this weather, the Center of Hope is here to help.